Hello guys. How are you guys doing? It's been a while since I posted on my YouTube channel, but I'm here again today and I want to give you guys an amazing strategy for boom and crash. Okay. So I've been having a sell on crash 1000 using the strategy since yesterday. All right. So what happened was uh, it, it was in accordance with uh, the strategy, but only 15 minutes and we took the trade since then we have been holding but now let me show you guys what the strategy looks like so you use it on the one minute time frame you allow the market to actually get to the sell zone just like we have here all right you can add the indicator window you can clearly see that we had the sell zone so what you're gonna do you're gonna wait for the moving average crossover before you take yourselves when that happens you just take yourselves right so here you can clearly see that the market the spike happened and we were at the sell zone so you can clearly see here the spike happened we are at the sell zone and then there was a moving average crossover we were sold guys take 10 candles 20 candles see we just made money so here again the market being at our sell zone okay you can clearly see if you look at the indicator window, see also that right. You can just take yourselves 10 to the candles and out of the market. So, same thing here, it, it's always the same thing. Okay, so can you use the strategy in the hard time frame? Can you use it on the one minute time frame? I did the strategy because I know there are a lot of people out there who are actually working, so you just need to scalp, guys. So, you see, you see that. All right so we are not going to spend too much time on this video all right because it's actually very simple there's nothing to waste time about so you see the market is what at the sell zone we have our moving average crossover so you see that all right just sell guys you see the market being at the sell zone you see the moving average crossover you just sell guys you see here all right sell take your 10 20 candles you're out of the market guys so here the reason why it's actually looking this simple or easy is because we are in a range of market so the market is actually just trading between the support and resistance whenever the spike happens we are at what the support level so you see all what we are doing we are just in between these range okay the one hour range all right so see between the support level and the resistance level is just same with that so it's actually easier to scalp the range market using the strategy guys it's actually a lot lot more easier so and it's actually sweet to do that okay it's actually very sweet to do that so here we have uh, the spike all right we were at the sell zone okay we have the moving average crossover guys Crossover. just take yourselves and make money guys so it's as simple as that fam so you see here we have a spy market being at the sell zone we have the moving average crossover take yourselves same thing still happened spike to the sell zone moving average crossover take yourselves you make money guys so here yeah, still the same thing happening market spike market spike to the sell zone so we have a moving average cost server check yourselves right make money let's look at the next thing the crash 1000 so i already started work for this crash 1000 index so it was still the same thing right for the crash you're going to be looking for buying opportunities right for the boom you're gonna be looking for selling opportunities guys so here we have the market being as a buy zone you take your buys upon the marine average crossover and take 10 candles when the wire spikes wait for the moving average crossover spike all right and clearly see that spike which is actually reflecting so you wait for the moving average crossover all right you make your money so the spike and then the get on to the side buy zone buy 
on the cross over of the moving average so in most cases where the market spiked like this all right it wanted to start buying a spike then fall back below then what i have to do even though there's a moving average cross over you have to wait for the market to actually push above that high before you buy all right wait for the market to push above that high before you buy all right so that's that so now look look at this thing. look at this now fam look at this all right we have the moving average crossover okay we have the moving average crossover all right so you take your buys see it's actually a spike to the buy zone we have the moving average crossover take your buys guys take your buys Have the market spike been to the down to the sell zone to the buy zone sorry we have the moving average crossover you take your buys come so you keep doing this keep doing this but don't be greedy okay so see you can drop to the buy zone have the moving average crossover take your buys so that's as simple as that fam so you see we have the market being what at the buy zone okay we have the moving average crossover okay you make your money guys so that's how the strategy is simple as so we can keep doing this all day you cannot keep seeing opportunities from so you see so like i said uh if the market is actually dropping and then you can just see a structure like this where in the case of downtrend so here you don't buy okay you wait for you wait for it to actually take this recent like if you have consecutive movement like that dropping 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 so what you're gonna do is you're gonna wait for the market to actually push above that area okay once it pushes above you can actually take a buy somewhere here and then make money guys so it's that simple guys it's just as simple so here again we have the market being on what at the buy at the buy zone okay we have a moving average crossover take your buys right make money so now let me show you the settings for this particular strategy for the strategy we have on the main window we have the moving average period seven shift zero method linear weight applied to weighted close all right time frame all time frame style is uh four pixel by right, color black all right we have the next indicator we are 12 shift zero meter linear width apply to weighted close all right style is uh four pixel color red okay click on done the next indicator we have the latest trend index period 14 apply to close levels 90 and 10 style uh, zero pixel color white okay you want it to be the same with your background color and the last thing get up, we have the period 50 apply to close level zero and then style is four pixel color black right as the community channel index so guys don't forget to follow us on the telegram channel like and subscribe this video like this video and subscribe to this youtube channel stay blessed